Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the year 2024 and welcome to chronic and communicable diseases. I will be posting a video once or twice a week reminding you about what's happening in the course. And for this day, I'd just like to point out some important information that you may already know if you've watched the other videos. The first is that under information, you will find the course syllabus and you will find information about student services if you need any student services. Then in content, you will find our units and the, how they are set up. So I wanna go over unit 1A and 1 right now to talk about the kind of things that are due this semester. So in 1A, every unit's set up the same way. If you look at the unit objectives and due dates, you will see that your disease request is due on today, the second by 5 p.m. You cannot do most of your other assignments until you submit that. So it's important that you submit that as soon as possible. Also due today by 11.59 is your introduction assignment and your discussion board is due tomorrow. That's the introduction to the course. Then what we have is the introduction on the material. So as you can see here, when you open the objective and due dates, the items, the other items that are due this week, on the fourth, you have one line 02, which is history of, of uh, healthcare and health systems in the United States. You have social determinants of health due on January 5th. You have one line 04, which is chain of infection on January 5th. If you'd like to do an extra credit assignment, that's due the 6th, that's optional. On the 6th also, you have the online chain of infection, another assignment on that. And then on the 8th of January, you have a checkpoint that's due. And so just a little bit about the checkpoint. In your disease choice that you submit, and I approve, you will be working throughout the semester on completing your final project. And there are twice during the semester that I check to see where you are. This is the first checkpoint, and you will submit information on what you've accomplished so far in your final project. And then I will do that again in another unit. Then you see the quizzes for unit one are open from um, the second until the seventh. And those, if you remember, those quizzes are all optional. They're designed to help you study for your test. And then you have two tests that will happen on January 8th, and they're open from the 8th to the 9th. They're open for almost two full days. And then the other thing to show you is you should be able to see this information. It tells you when tests one on lessons one, two, and three opens. It tells you what day it opens and what day it closes. And then you have test uh, one on le unit lessons four and five, and it also tells you what days they open and close. And that's for everything. So that's what to do this week. It's important that you keep that in mind, especially since we're such a fast paced course, no one should needs to fool, no one should fall behind because it'll be, be hard to catch up. So two critical things, make sure you get your assignment in where you're requesting your disease. And then the other thing to remind you, I have office hours from 7 to 8 a.m. on Thursday mornings. And if you need anything, please reach out. Um, I look forward to working with you, and I hope you have a great week in the course. Bye-bye, everybody.